All right now, uh, Kenny Crumpton kicking it this morning. Kenny, can are you going to play a little ball this morning with one of the ladies? Maybe get them out there, shoot around with them or something like that? Yeah, yeah. Um, you know what? Well, when we go to tournament town uh, later on, I'm going to play. Okay. But I, I don't want okay. to touch anything on yeah. this pristine court. Oh, yes. no. Yeah. Okay. It's too nice. It's too nice yeah, to touch. Took, it's very expensive <laughs> to lay lovely. that floor. I know that's right. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and you know what's really good? That just shows how much they are, are really making sure this is going to be a spectacular event, not only for us, but for the entire country. Destination Cleveland, the big cheese. Emily Flowers <laughs> here, how are you? I'm good, how Good to are see you, you Em. All right, you. well, uh, wow, We're, what, a, what a huge honor this is for us to have the NCAA Women's Final Four here. Cleveland is the epicenter, I would say, not only of women's sports this yeah. weekend, but of sports, sports in period. general. Sports period. It's Most all definitely. here in Cleveland. In now the let's land. talk about this because you know everything. <laughs> um, <laughs> let's talk about the different because it doesn't look like, I mean, there's nothing that says Cavaliers here there's for right now. So it's totally their house. This is the NCAA's house yeah. and they have made it theirs, but they've also made sure that Cleveland's part of it, which okay. is, we love. Now, what I just got is the uh, the logo is a guitar pick as a tribute, a little homage to yes. the Rock Hall, correct? Yes, to our rock and roll heritage here in Cleveland. So you've got the guitar pick, then you see the blue, mm -hmm. right, which is connected to our proximity to Lake Erie. Gotcha. Here at the top in the blue, kind of looks like the cross is um, the crossbars of the Main Avenue Bridge mm -hmm. uh, that runs over the Cuyahoga River. So you've got the circle, which is part of the state emblem. Yeah. Um, Little bits and pieces here and there, some and more obvious than over others. Over here, they made sure that they put the Cleveland script. That's right, the iconic Cleveland script. So we'll call this the obvious part yeah. of uh, <laughs> of the court and the, the tribute to Cleveland. So, of course, just like our iconic signs that people can go and take their pictures at. Yeah, and then over here on the end, that little... It looks like a rip, and that's on purpose? Yes, right? So concert posters, right? When, you know, you leave the concert and you really want to take the poster with you and you rip it down, right? And sometimes you get it all, and sometimes you get a bit of a frayed edge. So that's, that's what that what ripple that is. As we walk over here, so we were just wondering, okay, this beautiful, brand new, pristine court. What happens to it after the tournament's over? Well, so there are 262 panels here gotcha. and they each weigh 165 pounds and the school that wins mm -hmm. gets first right of refusal um, on buying it. On buying the and court. And sometimes okay. they do or sometimes they'll buy parts of it um, and give it to donors. Other times there might be a successful alumnus who wants to buy it and cut it into pieces and maybe raise money for the school's alumni association wow. or another charity. So it won't go to waste. It whatever will not happens. go to waste. Yes. If it goes to that school though, that's a practice facility court. Oh Talk about recruiting power. Yeah, you have to have all the recruits take a picture of that logo. That's that is right. so awesome. Well, we are super duper excited. We're gonna to talk to you a little bit more about yep. what's happening all in the city, it. how this is huge for us. And Lamont's gonna end with uh, the logo up there. It's just so cool. All right, we're gonna go back to you guys in the studio.